friends. So today we're going to do a project with newspapers and watercolors. You need a glue stick and you need scissors. So scissors, a glue stick, newspaper, and watercolors. So the first thing you're gonna do is you can cut your newspapers and make lots of different shapes. Let's see, so first we're gonna cut whatever shapes we want out of our newspapers. You can cut your newspapers into strips, into shapes, and then when you've done cutting them, you can glue it onto your paper to make a picture on your paper. Let's see. So we're cutting. You can cut out letters. You can cut out words. You could make words. You could make words. With yes. Cutting out letters. So. This one looks like the sun, so I'm going to cut that out. Let's see. Ooh, look at those leaves. This is going to be my middle. That's going to be your middle. I see a little house. I see a sun. You see a sun in yours. A star, sun, like a starry sun, mm. like on an island. Mm -hmm. I cut out a bird's nest. <laughs> Oh, there's a nice picture of a family on vacation. Oh, look at that nice picture. Mm -hmm. Is this yours? That's yours. Let's see, what else did I see? A piano. I love to play the piano. Do any of you play the piano? I do. You know what, I know some of you take piano lessons. I, I play, remember. I play the piano. You play the piano. I remember some of you leaving and going to piano lessons. I took piano lessons for many, many years when I was younger. And I'm learning how to play And you're piano. learning how to play the piano? Playing the piano is so much fun. So is playing other instruments. Mm -hmm. mm. Okay. Well, look at this pretty picture. Isn't that pretty? Oh. I am almost out of room on my paper, so I am almost to the watercoloring step. I wonder what's going to happen when we add watercolors to our picture. Does anyone know? What's going to happen to our pictures? Mm. Mm. I smell something good. You do? Is it the glue? Yes. Uh -uh. Okay, I'm going to put one more picture 
And then we, I will be ready yeah, to well, glue. Done. Are you ready to color, to watercolor yours? Mm -hmm. Okay. Wait, what am I gonna watercolor? You're gonna watercolor over the newspaper. That was a good question. Won't I be around the newspaper? You could do around the newspaper. I'm going to watercolor on my newspaper. But I want to still show it, so I'm going to do it around. Okay. And there's many. And we have two different paints. We do. Paint we have a watercolor for you and a watercolor for Which me. Which one do you want to use? Whichever one you don't want to use. That was such nice asking. Yeah. So there's mine that I cut out of the newspaper. So now I'm going to watercolor it. Don't forget to put the cover on your Maybe glue stick. Maybe we could use both because one has colors that another doesn't have and one has Okay, yeah, we can take turns doesn't. sharing them. You're right. Yeah, we could. because some have colors that the other one doesn't have. Okay, so let's see. Mm. So I'm going to watercolor over my picture. What's it going to do? You're doing around and I'm doing on. Yeah. Yeah. And we'll see what color of water looks like at the end. Oh, what color do you think our water is going to look like at the end? Hmm? I don't know. I don't know. Okay. Because this one doesn't have pink and this one does. Oh. And this Oops. one doesn't have regular purple, just bluish purple, but the other one has regular purple. What's your favorite? What's your favorite? What's your favorite color? Something's calling? happening to the water. What's your favorite? What's your favorite? What's your favorite color, Colin? Hmm. I don't have one. I like them all. <laughs> What's your favorite color? I like a lot of colors too. But my three favorite colors, my top three of colors are blue, green, and orange. But I can't pick just one. I knew your favorite color was green. You knew? One of them. Mm -hmm. Do you know the colors of the rainbow do you know the colors of the rainbow there's red orange yellow green uh-oh <laughs> red orange help me out red orange yellow green what comes next Blue. Blue. What comes next? Purple. Purple. And violet, right? And violet. Yeah. Oh, I got stuck there for a minute. Do you know the colors of the rainbow? Do you know the colors of the rainbow? There's red, orange, yellow, blue. Again. <laughs> I meant to do orange. Again. I have to write them down in order to remember them. I'm trying to think of some color songs. Do 
you know any color songs, Colin? I can try to make one up. Ooh. There's red and blue and purple. Mm. No, that doesn't sound right. That doesn't sound right. Hmm. So see what's happening to my pictures? Mm -hmm. So I'm coloring, I'm watercoloring mm -hmm. over the pictures. And it's just making a really cool painting, isn't it? Let's see. It's just changing it from the black and white of the newsprint into a colorful newsprint, right? I got a joke for you. Let's see if Colin knows the answer. Hey, Colin, what is black and white, just like a newspaper, right? And red all over. Do you know that one? What is black and white and red all over? What do you think? What is black and white? Newspapers? Ah, uh, yeah. Newspapers are black and white and they're red all over. Mm, I got that. One. Or you could say a zebra reading a newspaper, right? Which way do you like it? Just a newspaper or a zebra reading a newspaper? Just a zebra. I mean, just a newspaper. Just a newspaper. So what is black and white and red all over? A, a newspaper. newspaper. For a second, I thought that it was actually the color red, but it's mm. red. Oh, no. I kind of like your idea of painting around it, too. So I might do that too, now that I've painted all of my newspaper pictures. And you could cut out more newspaper pictures. You could fill your whole page with newspaper pictures. You could fill your whole page with newspaper pictures. I just cut out some. But look at that, that's pretty cool. So now I'm gonna paint around the newspapers too and see what I'm it looks done. like. You're done, you wanna show them yours? Mm -hmm. So he just painted around the newspapers. He did not paint hey, mommy, the newspapers. Some, wait. He kept them black and white. Some got on the back. That's okay. Show them the cool back. Yeah. So you could do lots of different art projects with a newspaper. I've seen some people make boats out of newspapers. I've seen some people make hats out of newspapers. And now, since I finished early, maybe I could make another one. Mm, maybe you could. But I don't want to. Okay. But yeah, so you could paint the newspaper and you could paint outside of the newspaper. You could paint so you fill your whole paper. That's what I'm going to try to do is paint so that I fill my whole paper. Hmm, that's a good idea. That's a good idea? You're going to paint your whole paper? No. No? I like it how it is. Yes, you did. A, I like the colors you used. What colors did you use? Hmm. Yellow, green. Orange, pink. Yellow, green, and orange, pink. The orange kind of looks like brown, but it's supposed to be orange. You know what? I was just painting with brown, and my brown kind of looked like black. Maybe it's because I just used black. So maybe I didn't get all the water off. All the paint off. What do you think? Mm. <clears throat> Almost done. Oh, I want to show them. Almost done. A little bit left. Let's see and what mine color. Mine is all done. Do I want to use for the end? Do you like how I did this? I do. Done like a real world. I do. So newspapers. You can do many things with them. You can read them. Colin's favorite part to read is the comics. 
in the newspapers. That would be a fun page to cut the comics and to and I was like paint those and I was like and I was like don't use those ones. You didn't want me to cut the comics, so we didn't. Just make sure when you're done with your newspapers, you recycle them. Right? Newspapers are something that can get recycled. And we recycled some of them by doing artwork. There is my finished painting. What do you think? Oops, one, that one isn't staying down. I didn't glue that one that good. Hang on and I'll show you again. Ooh, or... Let me show you something really cool, too. So there's my finished product and he is with not the newspapers. Me. But watch this. Watch this. Wait till you see what's going to happen. Now, you can do something else after. Whoa. What do you think is going to happen? Is that going to look really cool? Yeah, just be careful you don't whip the paper. No. So look at that. I decided maybe I wanted a little bit of white on it. So I took off a paper and I have a little bit of white. But if I decide oh, I really want it all to be colorful again, then I can put it back on. Right? So if you want it all colorful or you want some white, there are so many different ways different things you can do with your newspaper. So go have fun painting. Bye-bye for now.